Hey guys, how's it going? Superfly Kev here, and welcome back to Armed and Dangerous. Now we're going to do Roman's Little Diversion, which is to keep the King's Men occupied while the Lionhearts get the keys, set the oppressed Onion Mine Workers free. So our objective is just to get nine peasants to their homes. Alrighty. And I'm doing this by myself. Right? I don't have allies. No, my friends are not with me. Alright, so I gotta return one there. Whoa. Oh. Where did I come from? Oh, there's a guy up there. Okay. Cool. Alright, I can return one there too. Cool, I got the jumper pack. Oh god, this fucking sniper. Oh. I got him. There was another one. What is when someone else shot me? Oh, it was this guy. There's another sniper. Where is he? There he is. I see him. Come on. Why am I not hitting him? Really? Okay, I'm getting surrounded by baddies. I'm probably going to have to fly up to that dude if I want to get rid of him. For some reason, my shots weren't working. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, there's nothing up here. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna need ammo for my sniper rifle. Hopefully that's rifle ammo right there. Oops, shit! I didn't mean to double jump. When I double jump, this is what happens. Okay, yeah, that was sniper rounds. Oh crap! There's a lot of people here. I'm getting shot from all sides. Whoa! This game is nuts sometimes. I think there's a peasant up here. But there's one right here. You're welcome. So we got Bob the peasant with us. Okay, cool. Thankfully, there was a wall here. Alright, we got two peasants. Oh, shit. The guy with a rocket launcher over there. Whoa, what the hell's going on? My camera's going through the architecture, and that's really weird. Okay, that's very disorienting. Alright, I'm trying to look for the guy that had the, uh, only got one sniper round left. Oh, there's the guy with the bazooka. No, that wasn't him. I thought that was him. Alright, let's return these guys home real quick. I got two homes here I can return them to. It's just so funny to me. It's like they forgot to animate them. Whoa, it's... I'm pretty sure they didn't forget. I'm pretty sure this was done intentionally. You know, to not animate them running behind me or anything. Alrighty. Sniper rounds. Alright, let me take care of this guy over here. Did I kill him? It didn't. Of course it didn't. Cool, thanks for the health. The rocket guys have rocket launchers. That's not fair. Whoa. Alright. Let me get in the tower real quick. Oh, okay, I can't. There's a grate on it. Alright. They drop sniper ammo. Alright, anybody here? <coughs> Excuse me. Shit. It's a lot of dudes with rocket launchers. Alright, I wanna land, please. I wish there was a button that you can just drop down. You know, without killing yourself, obviously. Where the hell's the pub in this map? Oh, there's a peasant right there. Yippee! 
Alrighty. We still got six more to get, besides, the, you know, not not counting the guy I have, you know, floating behind me. Alright, I'm gonna take this guy out. This guy's been bothering me for a while now. Oh, I thought there was somebody there. Trying to get this guy. There he is. I got him. Where the hell is the pub? There's another dude here. Alright, there's a drop-off area. Shit. I don't know what the hell that was. Probably was another rocket. But something blew up right next to me. Okay. I was just checking to see if there was anybody on this platform. Whoa. Okay, these guys have some serious firepower. Oh, it's that tower out there that's trying to kill me. There's a peasant right here, too. Oh, come on, dude. Really? All right, let's jump on this tower over here. All right. Cool. There's an invisible wall here or something that's not letting me go through. Yep. Son of a bitch. And there's another tower here. Alright. There. Okay, I could take these things out by just shooting them with my machine gun. I don't need a uh, rocket launcher or anything like that. Jesus. Uh, let's take care of this asshole. That's not fair, man. Like, my bullets only get a certain distance before they don't work. Oh, there's a peasant up here. Okay. Or at least I know where the four are. Where four of them are. There's one over there. But I want to take care of this rocket launcher, dude. I got him. Cool. There's just bullets everywhere, man. Alrighty. The enemy definitely is armed and dangerous. Sorry for the pun. I can only carry three at a time. Shit. Okay. I can't capture that guy. Alright, there's one over here, so I know where two of them are now. Alright. Oh, there's the pub. And these are all the houses I can drop these guys at. Oh, that's not nice. That dude's getting divorced. I mean, it probably is for the best. You're free. You hear me? Free. I don't know what their relationship was. I still need four more to find. Alrighty. So, I came out of there. I'm sure. I mean, your friend just got divorced, so. Sounds like being kidnapped ends and end, ends a marriage, you know? Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright. Let's drop off these two guys, and then we need two more, and that ends the mission. Well, let's get rid of these, because they keep spawning out of these freaking houses. Thankfully, this mission is not that punishing compared to the others. You're welcome. Alright, so I need to still find two more. Alright, let's see what wacky weapon they give me. Hang up job defending the mountain villages, Mr. Norman. Care for some guns? Sure. Alrighty, um... Let's get the land shark gun. And we got a knockout bomb. What the hell does that do? I haven't been using the other bombs that I've been getting. 
Like I had a traitor bomb or something that basically will make them like fight against each other and I haven't been using that. Why? It's because I didn't know they existed. It's not because I chose not to, to use them. Okay, I'm trying to see if there's, a, if there's one of the peasants up here. It doesn't look like it, but there is like a mine shaft over here. I don't trust a place where you can't see the sun. Me too. I've been in a cave and um, it was, you know, it was pretty scary. Especially when the lights go out because then you can't see anything. All right, there's a peasant here. I need one more dude besides this guy. Anybody up here? Oh, there he is. Thankfully, they have a little green circle above their heads. It makes it easier for your, for me to see where they're at. All right, come on. Come on. There we go. So I believe there's two houses here I can drop them off in. There's one. And there's two. Yep. <laughs> the dialogue is funny. All right, let's see. What's this one? You're a diamond geezer. Okay. You're a true champion of the people. Without workers, this evil mine will grind to a halt. Onions don't mind themselves, you know. Onion miners. Because, you know, onions grow in caves. Maybe they do. If onions grow in caves, let me know in the, in the comments below. I'm, maybe they do. Maybe there's special onions that grow in caves where it's really dark. I don't know. Meanwhile, King Forge's palace. We don't have much time. They're nearing the wild wood. The wild wood gate has stood impassable since the Lesser Onion War. But one of our spies tells us they are seeking out the Lady of the Pond. She has the key Legends. of... Legends. No such person. But that does give me an idea, Stig. I have a mission for you. What are you doing? Stick to experiment. Uh, ah, interesting. Please, son, tell us all about it. Stick grind teeth into calcium dust. Right, well, stop that. I want you to take a division of my soldiers <laughs> and head to the Wildwood Abbey. Uh, sire, wouldn't it be better if... Silence! Prince Stig is ready to lead an army. We must show the people his natural talent for leading men at arms, even if it is against a foe that won't even be there. Prince Stig, your army awaits. Go, my son. Go down there and lead them into battle. Now, the true power of... Use the stairs! Jesus. He took out like four of his guys. <laughs> Patience. She will appear when she's ready. <coughs> what does that mean? When she's had her hair done? After the gills have been waxed? Oh, this is pointless. <laughs> Jonesy. What? Well, what, did, what did he just do? Well, Rex, put it this way. Your beloved lady of the pond is now lying face down in the water with some major head trouble. It was a bleeding accident. Well, get her out. Jesus. <laughs> Hello. Nice to meet you. What? Who? Oh? We're here for the um, great keys of... Uh... You? You for a rocket, me? No, I didn't. You tripped as you were coming out of the pond. I... Pond? What was I doing in the pond? Why, you live there. You are Zembaling. The great lady of the pond. Ha! What a bunch of rubbish! It's true. We are here for the legendary keys of Zardos. <laughs> what are you talking about? My name's Sarah Hillman from the next village. I want a homeless shelter for startled sheep. Now go and play your pathetic D and D games elsewhere. Oof. <laughs> I can't even swim, you silly man. She's been in that pond for over two thousand years. Jonesy, you idiot! Well, then she should at least know how to dodge skipping rocks. Hey, what's that? The oh. keys of Zardos. I guess she dropped them. 
He hit her so hard she forgot she was the Lady of the Lake, I guess. Oh, is this another terror section? Alright, crush the king's army. Jonesy and Ruxus are on their way with the key of Zardos. But there's an army between you and the wild wood gate. Use this old terror to take out the king's forces. Survive as long as you can. Wipe out as many troops. You will be captured if you let 100 grunts enter the village. Alright. And as always... Oops, sorry. Alright, where are they coming from? Oh, I see him. Come on. I wish they gave me like a rocket turret. And thankfully the turret doesn't overheat. That's one thing that gets super annoying in games. Alright, they all keep coming in front. Uh oh. They're getting a little bit too close. Alright, I gotta stop aiming down sights now. No, no you won't. Must not let anybody through. Oh crap, that was a big dude right there. Okay, I killed him. He wasn't that much of a problem. What's that? I found a token. Over the top. Alright, cool. It's a difficulty level. Probably the hardest one, maybe? I can imagine this game gets very cheap at, at higher difficulties. Alrighty. The, the Shrub Patrol. Nice, they're here. They really don't like vegans. Because plants don't have a voice. You know, animals do. They let you know when they're in pain, but plants, they don't. Maybe. Oh, wow. They dropped me a gift and I shot at it. You must not go over the wall. Nice. They're dropping bombs. We're getting support this time around. Is the Shrub Patrol responsible? I mean, this guy parachuted in. And he's the only one here. Oh, they're retreating. We did it. Well done. Just in time, your friends have the keys. You meet them at the Wildwood Gate. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Ooh, we're almost to half uh to you know half a a, a million. I mean half a billion dollars. Shouldn't there be someone guarding? Halfway, you? almost. Yeah. You know the villages. 
The keys of Zardos are a fairy tale. Sure you tell me how you got them, Rex. Not a good idea. Right. Give me the kiss. What? You heard me. Give me the kiss. Give me the kiss now. Or your friends are dead. What the kiss. bloody hell is this man saying? Give, give him a kiss. No idea. <laughs> but you better do something quick. Give me the kiss now. <laughs> what the f are you doing? That's it. You're all dead. Hold it. Wait. Wait. Give me another chance. It's been a long time since I kissed a man. I can do better. Kiss. Holy you shit. Moron. I said give me that kiss. <laughs> Sorry. Our <I'm> mistake. <gasps> okay, gay. <laughs> oh, I never liked this place. Scarier than a room full of Germans. Oh. That was fucking great. All right, reach the uh, Wildwood Abbey. The king was on a, conv a convoy, or has a convoy of Goliaths carrying peasants to the abbey. There, they will be forced to weave baskets until they die. God damn, what a terrible fate. So we got to destroy three Goliaths and free the peasants. Return the peasants to their home. God, I'm still tearing up. Um, <laughs> take out the, the monks guarding the abbey road and then get to the walls. Okay, so destroy 12 monks. Kill three got lives and return three peasants home. The king's in and then those peasants. Alrighty. They don't give me my teammates anymore. Oh shit. Alright, let's just go. What are those sounds? I'm hearing some spooky crap here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dudes have like barrels and shit. All right, what guns do I have? Oh, well, they took away my shark gun. At least I have this. I guess I have the Hawking's rifle, which is the first gun you get in the game. I think I see them. Come on, man. Why are my bullets not working? At least he dropped a health kit. Oh. Nice. That was a good headshot. Oh. Shit. Alrighty. Alright, we gotta get to those Goliaths. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot I gotta put a bomb on these guys. Alright, that's one. Alright, I gotta stop this guy from going. Nope, nope, nope. Oh shit. Okay, I figured that was gonna happen. I'm trying to stop them before they get to the end. Alright. We're back. I'm gonna blow this guy up first and then grab this peasant and then work my way down the line instead of rushing because what got me killed last time alright let's blow this up first though I need health. Shit. I need health. Someone drop a health kit. Okay. This dude's gonna do me in. Oh, thank you, thank you. He dropped a health kit. 
Okay. I'm trying to dodge sniper fire. Alright, there's a dude up here. Alright. Shit. Drop a health kit, please. Oh, a health kit. Grab it before you die. One. Two. Okay. And there's a pub right in front of us. Jesus Christ. It's a fucking mountain machine gun up there. And there's one up here, too. Oh, thank you for the health kit. And there's another health kit up there, too. Okay. Okay, they're dropping plenty of health kits. I want to take out this guy first, though. Okay, he got off the machine gun. Alright, let me blow up this last behemoth. Oh, I just blow him up. Okay, cool. Now we gotta return them to their homes. Fucking monkeys with barrels. Alrighty. <coughs> so the farmer's wife says to him, she says, It's Roman, our hero. Gotcha. What do you have these guys? These guys just spawned in, didn't they? Alrighty. Time to book it. What's over here? I know this is going behind uh, the turret. Okay, I don't need any more of the uh, of the bombs. Alright, so the game is telling me to go this way. There's probably a peasant's house or something back here. Alright, it wants me to go up there. Oh crap, there's still snipers in the area. I need to be careful. There is a person's house here. Okay. There's two homes here. Oh, you magnificent bastard. Alrighty. I guess he lives ho at home alone. He didn't say anything. All right, and the last house is going to be right there. Yep. Oh. Okay, so now we just got to take out the 12 monks and then take out, get to the walls of the Wildwood Abbey. I've been out being kidnapped all day. Why can't people get a simple kidnapping right these days? I guess she didn't want her husband home. Okay, I don't think I take any fall damage. Did the music just stop? That was comedic timing. The music stopped whenever Roman hit the floor. That was some good comedic timing right there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You guys over here looking like Nazis and shit. Oh, shit. That's a lot of dudes that just showed up. All right, there you go. Have fun dealing with a shark. I can always use that. There you go. Now you guys go fight each other. Sounds like they're not having a good time behind me. S 
Yeah, see, it sounds like they're not having a good time. Okay, so where the hell are these monks at? Oh, there they are. I can't get him with the shark gun. Oh, shit. Five more monks? Okay. Okay, I killed all of them. Cool. Now we just gotta get to the gate. Alright. The gate's right here. Great job. <coughs> Within these walls, the Book of Rule awaits. Basket weaving? Well, you probably don't remember this, Rex. But your locking spell turned the Book of Rule into the Book of Basket Weaving. Usual brilliance. And their attempts to break the spell have turned them all into expert basket weavers. In fact, they're mad about it. Oh, that sounds so very dangerous. Well, could be. Yeah. The walls are too high to jump. Q, what do you think? Can you toss me? What? Can you toss me over? Oh, I could certainly try. Good lad. I'll open the door from the other side. Here, Rexus. I never really thanked you for getting us into this wood. I want you to have this. It's a wrist locator. Activate it, and I'll be able to find you wherever you are. Oh, we'll be fine. You just open that door so we can get to the book. Gosh, I've never been given anything like this before. Well, you know, it's just in case. Thanks, Romy. Wow. Oh. It doesn't mean we're engaged or anything. Actually, it does. What? It does mean you're engaged. What are you talking about? In the small print of the Early Doors Wrist Locator Handbook, it says that if you give a set to another person you are from that moment oh, on... Let me look at that. <laughs> ...that you are engaged. <laughs> right, give it back. But you gave it. <laughs> give me the bloody thing now! No, <laughs> oh, oh, give me... Right, now, Q, throw me over that wall. But our tea break... Now! Oopsie. <laughs> oh, you bastard! Psst, hurry up. All right, man. The <laughs> the uh, what do you call this thing? The um the dynamic between these characters are great. All right, guys. Um. I'll see you guys next time. I'm going to end it here. Don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good stuff if you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.